Guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Forest Hills Golf Club here in Augusta, Georgia. We have a very fun video today with friend of the channel, Matt Atkins. One v one on the back v1. nine here. Are you ready? Oh, I was born ready. Let's go. Hopefully, some better uh, some better lighting. But here we go. Hole ten. Oh, there we go. Hole ten. Beautiful day. Let's go. Little peeler off the right. Should kick down left and be pretty good, I think. Right? Oh yeah. Good shot. Pretty fine, I think. I don't know. It's either right in the fairway or just in the rough. That should be good. I don't think you can get those trees today. I don't think. No. That's no. good. Let's start. Let's start. Uh, today's going to be fun. I'm excited for it. And a beautiful day. What more could you ask for? How far we got? I got 124. Lots of tree issues, obviously. <laughs> How good is that shot? Are you kidding? Oh, no way. Wow. Good shot, bro. That was Thanks. sick. Too much sauce. But still, that was really good. The fact that you were able to get on the green from this, props. All right, here we go. 124 yards, pins right back there. And that's it, honestly, just a good solid pitching wedge. Oh my, what was that? It's like the, the quickest, like, Climbing. Just didn't set my turn up at all. Just out of sync. Open club face. Just the works. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Matt's putt at birdie. My putt at birdie. Not our best, but hey, we got putts at birdie here on the 10th hole. All right, here we go, par five, number two, into the wind, about 570 or 80 yards. I mean, not not even think about what we're getting there in two today. Maybe the cart path? Oh, world, George. Oh. Terrible camera work. Not sure the shot was, but my camera work there was awful. Dang, it went right, and then it cut the bridge. Thought it might sneaky hit the car path, but it hit something. It's gonna be a three shotter anyway, so. Nice. Heck, I might go get there too. If that gets a massive kick. Nah, it's not. It's yours, let's be real. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here we go, 270 yards. Uh, to a back pin, might be able to get at the front of the green. Might. Oh God, how about necky? Uh, get over that bunker, please. Okay. And I'm like 70 yards <laughs> in. It's okay. All right, here we go. Matt's ball. Put the little tree. Got a little layup here. <laughs> Super junk, actually. You know what? We were just laying up anyway, so... This shot's not that, not that important. How far we got? I got 163. Into a stiff wind here. There's the pen. Yeah, not the easiest, honestly. It's the right distance. Really good. Take that. Heck yeah, we gotta put a birdie after uh, that drive. Good shot. Here we go. Plenty of green to work with. Just gonna chase something back there. Oh, in what world? Oh my god. What a putt. What a putt. 
What? Dang, that was a great roll. Thanks. I mean, they have, they, yeah, they did not take it easy, easy on the, uh, on the pants, huh? No, yeah, like, this is, like, super right for this part of the green. Too firm. Oh, too firm. All right, next hole. Try to take some of the break out. All right. Through two, even par, all square. Par four, number 12, which is our third hole today. Coming up. you're going to see the entire 12th hole here. Hey, thank goodness you guys didn't have tracers on those ones. Holy on those God. shots. <laughs> Yikes. It's an opportunity to showcase our escapability. Yeah, we need you guys a service. <laughs> well, guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, welcome to a fun little match here in Augusta at Forest Hills uh, with Matt Atkins. Um, we got the Sony hopefully a little more dialed in. Um, I'm a little more mindful of the overexposed and the blown out shots. So I got, but again, guys, we're, we're trying to dial it in, trying as best as we can. But if you're not a subscriber, subscribe to the channel. Um, we have a lot of fun stuff here in 2022. Um, the PJ Tour season is about to get underway, which means yours truly will be following Wesley filming content. So you're not going to miss out, but one camera because we're trying to keep up with the speed of play. Um, and so, that's all you're gonna get today. My, uh, a few shots here or there, but still, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Matt, Atkin Matt Atkins is the man, and I'm excited for you guys to see Forest Hills and all of its splendor. Playing adventure golf here on the third hole, hole number 12. Uh, you hit it left. Hey, there's a par, par five number six is right there, um, but the, the green we're supposed to be playing is somewhere over there. Double cross. Oh, <laughs> This is amazing. Double cross of the century. Honestly, I hit that way more solid than I thought I was going to. Yeah, freshly, I mean, not, I mean, yes, it went right, but like, <laughs> yikes. <laughs> Just gonna hit and hope here. Just hit and hope, baby. Uh, yeah, we're, we're hoping it doesn't go in this pond to the right. Okay. It's forward. They got, they got through that, right? Yeah, it's forward. <laughs> Perfect. Sometimes you just gotta hit it through the biggest tree you see and hope it gets through. <laughs> 85 yards. <laughs> Wobble wedge. I realized standing over that ball I had no chance of getting there. Needed a sand wedge, and that's what that's the shot. That's what it looks like when you go full bore at a lob wedge into the wind. Not a lot of good comes from that, but you know, we gotta put it par. The adventures continue here on the uh, <laughs> daunting 12th, which is our third of the day. That's what it's working with. Wow. Nice shot. Holy cow. I hit, I was down there, I was like, dude, I can't, I've got 85 yards, I can't get this. It's like, I got like 90 yards into the wind uphill trying to hit lob wedge. You need a big gap wedge. Yeah, and so I'm like, well, that's the best here. I mean, honestly, <laughs> we just wanted to see how we, we've never played the hole in this fashion, so we just wanted <laughs> this to is see, awful. Yeah. see what it was like. I mean, Tommy, we've left ourselves some really really wild putts, huh? Well, this green is going to be a little wild. Buggy. What a par. Holy cow. Well done. I mean, it looked like a four the whole way. Honestly. Well done. Well That's done. We Even, one over, par three, number 13 upcoming. Here we go. 
There's the pin over there. 142 into the wind. I mean, we're talking probably 165. What, what do you got, Matt? I have an 8 iron. 8 iron, wow. Oh, daddy. Dang it, now what do I do? Do I hit not? Wait, that's coming back. That can go in. <laughs> Good shot. I mean, that was a few feet away from being a disaster. I mean, so and now we have, I mean, it's, it might be 10 feet, it might be two feet. We don't so really know. So I can hit nine, I can get like a nine there. You think, can I? Yeah, I mean, that was, what that was, that went through it pretty good. I mean, it's not that windy at the moment. You think a 160 shot, 155 shot's enough? I think, I think you hit full nine and you don't have to like kill it, but yeah. just a good solid nine. Uh, how good is that distance, though? Just kind of pulled it. Not bad. No, it's just it's it's visually hard to get it over to the people. Look at the shot, Matt. Just, I mean, that's tapping birdie. That's good. Gets him to one under. Mine, slight pull, but again, you see, perfect distance. That, hey, misses. We're okay with this. Come on, Matt. Come on. Woo. Come on. Matt, kids. Okay. Going to the fifth hole. Hole number 14. One under. One over. Let's go. Maybe I think it should stay in the fairway. Huh? Beautiful tee ball. Yeah, that's really good. Right down the right side, hugging the bunker. Just what you're looking for. I know. It's hard and it's pretty. Matt, so give us an update on what does your schedule look like uh, for 2022? 2022. So we just had our second little girl. Congrats, congrats. So I've just been enjoying some good family time and the season starts up um, here shortly. In the Bahamas, I won't be going to either of those. Uh, I'm gonna be doing the qualifier to play in the event in Panama, the mm -hmm. country. Um, that's kind of all I really looked at. I'm just focusing on that as, as my first event back and hopefully qualify into that. And get it going. And get it going, yeah. So that's what I'm looking at. Let's go. Yeah, this, uh, you guys have seen me play here once before. I think I shot 69, 66. Uh, played really well. But today, windy pins are tough. So it's honestly a very, very good test. Game feels halfway decent. Like, a, a little loose in some areas. But I think overall, if I can just uh, get a little more, a little more dialed, I think we can give Matt a little go for his money. Also, guys. What about the hole in one? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Let's go. It was literally the most nuts thing that I've ever done uh, on camera. Like, yeah, so it's part three course. Who cares? A hole in one's a hole in one. Doing it live first take uh, was wild. So, Matt, you got big shoes to fill. <laughs> Just kidding. I mean, I was close. Yeah. You know, I gave it my best shot. How far, how far we got? Uh, 145. 145. This thing is tucked back there. Ooh, my gosh. 145. Good luck. Starting a little right. Oh, it draws in there nicely. That's what we're looking for. Bad side of the me. Goodness gracious, good swing. Thank you. That's a piece. Oh, yes. Had a little buttery cut nine. I mean, look at this though, people. The fact that we hit it on this little tongue, two shots inside. 12 feet, really good. I mean, heck, playing my cut, trust my cut, that was huge. And him playing this floaty draw was really amazing as well. So, really good. Pin, balls. Gosh, of course. Why not? Big, keep the lead. 
Why not? Two under, even, yeah, heading to 15, par four. Time for some slow-mo. Well guys, that's exactly the reason why if you're not comfortable over tee shot, don't hit that club. Like me, you guys know I fade my driver. Well, we had a hard left to right wind. Uh, the trees over there, so I couldn't start my fade left. So I tried hitting like basically like a straight shot. Um, again, that's where the block to the right because indecision, not fully committing, but whatever, it's fine. Again, swing wasn't bad, just the mindset. Hey, look at the, uh, look at the break I got, yes. Well, 9,500 yards to that pin right there. Breaks it in. I mean, what an awful par that is. George has an opportunity here to get back in the match. He's two down. Four to go. Oh, he reads it perfectly. A lot of people miss that high. Back Let's go. Hold to eight. The most volatile golf in the CSRI. 16, 17, 18. One under, two under. All right, so we just let a group play through, but what are, what are your thoughts, initial thoughts on George 2.0, which is now hitting fades here in 2022? Better than the last time you saw me with the irons, maybe? I mean, I, I honestly don't think you needed any work. You know, you, you, you stripe it better than you think you do. And it's like awesome. now, now you're just more, you know, maybe you're feeling more versatile, feeling more confident hitting a fade. You could always hit a fade. Yeah. You hit fades with your driver. So uh, it's, it's in the tank there. So now you're just, you know, maybe that back left pin a couple holes ago now you're committed to hitting it closer because you know it's not going to go as far left so maybe maybe okay. uh we got to watch out for you here in 2022 <laughs> gonna, yes gonna, gonna get off the gonna get off the youtube, YouTube tour scene and and go straight to the the corn ferry and pga tour so who knows that's a stretch but what are y'all thinking here um first few videos of 2022 kind of sticking to the fade i think what y'all are seeing is a little more consistency but hole 16 165 back left pin, nine iron. Little green, a little quick, gotta go. Hey, for a miss, 25, 30 feet up the hill. It's fine. Hung it out a little right, same line. So bad. Oh, <laughs> you can get ready. Oh, <laughs> good putt, good, good three, Thank you. good three. Again, we'll take eight, three, e two easy threes on a, on That's a the part three. Yeah. Missing high on a side winder ends up right next to the hole. Right, we've been talking about these last few holes, but this is where it gets crazy. Par five. Hole 17, which are eight. And then drivable par four, 18 to finish. Woo! One stroke difference, two under for Matt, one under for me. Yeah, I mean, this is honestly a great opportunity to showcase how you can shoot four or five under, just kind of slapping it around, yeah. so. I agree. Finish strong. This is a big tee ball, kind of an awkward tee shot. Kind of helps it being downwind, should straighten out any offline shot. Need to hit a good one to be able to have a realistic shot of getting it on in two. Set up for a fade, hits a big push Fine. up the, up the right. right. Just be the fairway fish. Up just in the rough, not bad. It's a good swing. 
Very, very nice. Here we go. 270. Pins back there, back right, uphill. It's going to take a good one. Matt's got about 260, 255, so definitely he will easily be able to get there. But me, cut three wood. Let's go. Think I got that high soft? Think I got the cut in here? So, I mean, George in 2022 hits nothing but cuts. All right. They get people they want, huh? I was going for the I was going for the angle over there. I got you it, it, shoot up the grid. You know, hey, Bernie is very much in play. What in the freak was that? Man, he overdid it. Are you right? I'm in the bunker. Yeah, if you're gonna miss somewhere. Left is not great, it's not bad, but I'd much rather be over there to the right, but calling the high softy Will Miles special from right here. Wowzers. Wowzers. Do I need my putter? Yep. <laughs> So much sand. God, if this wants to sling across the hole or if it wants to stay a little straight. It's an age old question. I'm gonna go with, it's gonna try to stay a little straight. Wow, right. just dead straight, pours it in. Like we said, he was never going to win the hole, and <laughs> we're not known for being a good buck player. We're actually known for being all the worst, but... And up and downs and up and down. All right. One shot advantage for me. Going into a drivable par four with OB left. Anything can happen, honestly. Stay tuned. Here we go. Hole 18, drivable par four, two under, three under. Drivable, like I said. Ooh, front left, Woo. too. Woo. Also, if you're not a follower or subscriber on Twitch, we got a lot of fun, a lot of fun content going down on that channel. So if live golf is your thing, uh, come and check me out. It's linked in the description. PJ Tour access, PJ Tour live streams, uh, match content, just a lot of different stuff than what you're gonna find here on YouTube. But if it's not your thing, who cares? But enjoy it. Uh, now let's go back to the action. Here we go. Hole number 18, our ninth of the day. About 285, 290, 300 ish, but today in the cold, just a full driver. You see the pin right there, front left. Gotta go for it. Come on, win. Blocks it out to the right a little bit, but that's gonna leave himself a pretty good pitch shot at it, maybe in the bunker. Fine, we got a lot of green to work with, but man, that was, that was close. All right, we're going for broke here, because why not? Oh my gosh. Well, with a one-stroke lead and the softest, prettiest cut you've ever seen to the center of the green. Oh, sit. Sit. All right, I think it stays short of the back part. That could, that can wrap it up. George, that was, George can still make his shot, and no, my putt is not easy, so no, we'll that see. That was sick, good shot. Thank you. Well, guys, a wild turn of events like Matt was just saying. There's my ball. It carried the bunker. We're on the green. Matt's a little closer. We got a 90-footer. It's, it's going to be tough, but hey, we got to put an eagle. So you're saying there's a chance? <laughs> there's a chance, baby. Well, it is official. Two putts for the win. Two putts for the win, one putt. And a solid for... four under 32. Yeah, I mean, honestly, make this, this would be like a miraculous five under on the line. Oh, baby. Oh, man. 
Oh, come on. Dang, I thought that was it when I hit it. Well, it's about. Just take the victory walk. Just take, just take it, enjoy it. That's 2 and 0 on the day right there, George. Yeah, if you didn't. I mean, four under, back nine, four under for the day. Yeah, we live streamed on Twitch earlier. He smoked me there. We'll beat by one. Yeah, I wouldn't say smoke. I think it was kind of a. Nice job. Nice win. George, just go ahead and knock this in for the fans at home. Showing them that you can shoot a little three under on the back here at Forest Hills. Beautiful little, track. I think just outside, just outside right. Flip. Yes, pretty, pretty straight putt. Ooh, didn't move. Didn't move. Good well, stroke. Can't be too mad at it. No, it was a good putt. Beautiful day to play. Enjoy it, brother. Well, that is a wrap. Shout out to Matt, Matkins. What else? We Matchkins, Napkins. All the kins in the world. Yeah, all the kins, but he played well. Four under 32. I shot, I mean, that putt right there, had there been a little more effort, I might have made it, but still, I'm not Matt. 32, or sorry, 34, two under par. Um, solid plan. But Forest Hills, amazing. amazing. Uh, company was amazing. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe to the channel, like it, comment. Uh, let me know what you want to see. Stay tuned for more. See y'all.